we'd also have a town mascot out there. And in a moment, Martin will be looking over there and we will see young Alex Padbury. And we've uh, met granddad, mum and dad, and um, talk about small world. Uh, I was born in Cleethorpes and I was brought, out, brought up in Sandhurst, uh, which is about 15 miles down the road here, if that, I should think. And that's where he lives. So young Alex, who is out there and will be having a kick about, He's met everybody, he's meeting everybody again now. OK, 17 minutes played by the way, no score. And to be fair, no real chances at either end. Town have looked OK. We might look more OK in a minute. That's Arnold, just past the post. Good effort by Arnold. Pittman into the corner. That's nicely done. Into the middle it comes. Has that ball gone? It's gone deep, certainly very deep. Oli Palmer chases it. He wants support. He's done very well. Robertson has Clay square of him. Arnold gets it back to Craig Clay at distance. One through the middle. Pittman is knocked to the ground and blazed over the top. Look how high that's gone from Nathan Arnold. Toto, oh it's got away, oh what a poor, poor finish, straight through the middle of the town defence, John Goddard absolutely blazes it over the top and we were opened up there, they won the header, they got the ball knocked inside, all of a sudden there was a lot of space there and Woking well, you'd have liked to have thought that town would have got the ball on target but I'm afraid Goddard absolutely well off it. Ollie Palmer can't reach, Disley can. That's a good ball. McCreth, in it comes now. It's not away yet. Pittman leaves it. Oh, across the face of goal. Couldn't get a touch on it. Well in there by Pearson, who'd come across. Arnold snaps it forward. Palmer will chase. He's going to make life difficult here, and he has. Ollie Palmer inside. He's being held off. Still Palmer going. Blocked. Can he settle for a cut? That was a. Well, that's a shove. That was just an out and out shove for me. Palmer was shielding the ball, holding it away from the defender. The defender pushes him over. Up we go. He's won well. Needs to be won again now. Oli Palmer over his head and over the top of the crossbar. Good one, good one. Oh! Toto got in front of everybody. Couldn't guide it. Over the top of the crossbar. Betsy stands on it, still gets away with it, into the middle it goes, need to be careful here, it's not a bad effort, something out of nothing. McEwen's ball, who's chasing? Still in there, Ollie Palmer off his heel, deflected, off the post, in now! Oli Palmer followed it in. Good man. It's what he does. He's come back. He scored the goal. Town go 1 0 in front. Well, we got the ball in early. We got that early touch onto it. It came back off the post. First man in there, Oli Palmer. Pittman congratulates him. We worked well for that. Carl Magne saying to the town fans, let's have it. Well followed in, that's what you do. You get in there, picking up pieces. Did it very well. Woking nil, town one. Well for me it is anyway. There's his kick. Pittman goes up, oh, nearly cleared it. Disley, nicely done. Pittman gets it back to Palmer. Now back to Pittman, can he move on with this one? He can, and he's still going. Blazed it over the top, he wasn't a million miles away. 
didn't quite get away from his foot. He had to get over it and around it. James McEwen uses Toto. Big clearance. Oh, crikey almighty. It could be an effort on goal nearly. If Graham Shearsmith, our stats and st uh, statistician, writes that down, I'm going to kick him in the proverbials. <laughs> <laughs> He's writing it, he says. <laughs> Whack. <laughs> Blasted back as offside. Oh, no flag. No flag. And wider the mark. Looked offside by a yard. Arthur, Jones forward, pinched by Robertson, Pittman, now he can turn and look up and go, looks for the pass, that's got through to McCreth, still Jack McCreth drags it across. Pittman did well there to get the pass away. Anybody doing the old coupons would have said, well that's just about a bank of draw, but um, whoops, Ollie Palmer just slips, Magne gets in, and again, that's a foul on Magne. Careful, taken quickly, McCreth to the byline, clips it back, that's a goal! That's a good piece of work by Town! Quick free kick, quick thinking! I'm assuming that's Pittman underneath that pile of players, I reckon it is. Yes, and doesn't look at Magne. Uh, and a yellow card down here as well. Chris Arthur didn't think much to the free kick being taken quickly. But we did. The referee allowed it. Quick piece of thinking. McCreth hit the byline, pulled the ball back in, and Pittman got in there before the goalkeeper, straight through his hands and into the back of the net. I reckon that's 19 minutes into this second half. Can he make a star of himself, at least for the moment? Let's see. Good effort. Really good effort. Back in comes a header. Toto away. Well, it was a great free kick. It was an even better save. And the clearance, well, we got in there when we had to get in there. Well, it went right for us, didn't it? Good game again today by Pearson and by Toto. Cross comes in. Who's looking for it? There's the header. Wider the mark. It wasn't a bad one. Scott Rendell, number nine. Murta's ball in to the back post. It's going to be a goal back. We didn't mark. James McEwen, unhappy. I think it's Goddard who got the touch. Ball comes in at us now. There's the header again, it's one again. Looking towards the linesman, I can't think what on earth for. Oh, a bit of daftness here, James McEwen and Soul, I think. Now, what's the referee going to say here? James Raccoon was just taking all the time he can do to pick the ball up. I think the referee will say, just let's be big fellas and get on with it. Thank goodness for that. Back come Woking. Well claimed by Robertson. Now at distance. Blasted in, why not? Why not? Craig Clay, he knew exactly what he was doing. What's the matter with that? Nothing much. And it's now putting town on a knife edge. Flicked on, Pearson was there, gets it back. And there's the full time whistle. Well, the knife edge has gone away, we've dulled it. And we've got another win on the travels here. 
great support by the town fans and a good win by town. This was always going to be a tough game. It was. And we got a good victory here, 2-1. Look at Carl Magne, what it means to him. And to the rest of the players. Big away win. Woking 1, Grimsby Town 2. This time next week we will be at Chester. That won't be easy. But we needed points in the bag from this one today. Woking not a million miles behind us in the league. We come here, we've got the points. We can do, do no more than we are doing. And that is to keep winning. And we have done. It's a good victory here today. Goal scorers John Paul Pittman, Ollie Palmer. Little bit of news going through there, I think, to Craig Clay about other results, probably. But the fact of the matter is, and here comes Carl Magne, he's made himself a real fan. Well, he had the inflatable a couple of weeks ago. Now he's got the hairy head. Why not? <laughs> <laughs> and the players love it. John Paul Pittman. And off we go. <laughs> and... Uh, <laughs> Toto has got the best one of the lot. <laughs> Quite right. Ali Palmer. This is a squad game for town now. Palmer's out there. John Paul Pittman's out there. Craig Disley. Well, uh, I don't know what to say about that. I think I saw him in a rock band in about 1974. <laughs> hey, it's been a fun day out for the town fans. Thankfully, it's been a fun result as well. Woking 1, Grimsby Town 2.